Oh yeah, that chosen shepherd, Hong huh, Kong. Well, he was forcibly sequestered up into the high pastures all spring and summer. Huh? Oh, he could occasionally be glimpsed, uh, bounding from boulder to boulder, uh, pausing only to strike uh, dramatic, exaggerated uh, poses. Well, athletic, huh? to highlight his natural prowess. And uh, needless to say, by the end of the summer, uh, this rogue, Budalak Shepherd was crazy with sexual frustration, uh, dripping too, <laughs> you know. Um, well, the hor horny shepherd bounds down uh, from the mountain on the last day of the Faux Festival, uh, a backwoods drunken bacchanalia, dwelling deep within the tribal memory of the Kafirs. Uh, well, after all, Dionysus, Bacchanalia, the more you drink, the more you get it on, huh? They're originally Greek. Well, the pumped up Budalak mates, oh yeah, phallically, publicly, in broad daylight, with as many women as he can po uh, possibly, uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. whether uh, they're married or fresh, young, virgin buds. Uh, and rather than run away from the rampaging Budalak, the village girls, uh, they strike erotic poses, bearing their female play, play part in an erotic, uh, seductive uh, pose. They imagine can attract the young Budalak to their pussy. Uh, Consequently, many children are born from this fucking festival, and uh, the newborns are especially revered in the tribe, yeah, by the whole family, uh, including the natural husband. It's an honor. Uh, once a year, uh, Sharif <laughs> loves to watch the Budalak phallically bulldoze the whole village in one drunken, orgasmic, repeatedly, afternoon. So, uh, Sharev invites his uh, queen, his royal queen from London. Oh, her skin is, 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 is fair. Uh, for her 19th birthday gift. Mm -hmm. To hide with him in the hawthorn bushes on the ridge overlooking, you know, uh, that Kafiri village nestled 9,000 meters. Yeah, up to Kalash Valley, huh? Well, the king and queen, enraptured by this amazing spectacle of healthy, upfront, whole village polyamory. No hang ups or jealousy by anyone. Everybody contributes good nat naturedly to the fertility festival for the fun. Thank you. And the, uh, you know, survival of the tribe. Well, these twin voyeurs from Mastuj, uh they become urgently affected by what they are witnessing. You know, sexually turned on. Um, oh, yeah, that watching the lust craze Budalak. Oh, an excited virgin maiden. Uh, splaying over a old growth uh, oak log, mossy, uh, her naked tits jangling temptingly uh, over the log there. Uh, the Buddha back, uh, Buddha like a plowser from behind. Yeah. Uh, and the royal uh, voyeur slipped down the pantalons. Yeah, that's right. In a slow, lust crazed writhing, tantric dream. <sighs> they masturbate one another. Yeah. What a rush. Uh, yes, with the encouragement of uh, the loving kindness of her king. Uh, Queen Latif. <laughs> 
flushes with a full body orgasm in pure nature at the Fell Festival of Fertility in the Kailash Valley of the Kafirs, where Moclair goats are uh, twined to trees and prayed to. And, uh, well, <laughs> Latif and Sharif meander hand in hand to their magnificent horses, <laughs> red faced with flushed with full body orgasms. They savor a dreamy ride home. Oh, past the glory of Chitral, 21,000 foot Tirik Mur, snow plumes blown off like a Tibetan flag off the summit before they collapse into a mountainous pillow pile. Yeah, silk pillows. Huh? In the opium throne room in the summer palace for an unforgettable, for another lustful night of, <laughs> that's right.